Yo, what's going on, ladies and gents? My name is Arbuckle. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are once again back on Fortnite Battle Royale, and I wanted to share with you guys how to complete the Smash and Grab Challenge, deal damage within 30 seconds after using a launch pad as quickly and easily as possible. Now, this challenge is actually much easier than a lot of players think it is, and, uh, and hopefully with this video, you guys will be able to knock this out in a single game. So to complete this, you just need to deal 100 damage within 30 seconds after using a launch pad. If you guys think about it, 30 seconds is actually a very very long time and this makes this challenge very easy if you're gonna play team rumble so here's what I would do first of all I highly recommend playing team rumble obviously you're gonna be able to respawn you're gonna have a lot of players that are just kind of going at each other no one's building too much it's, it's gonna be a very easy uh, challenge to complete in team rumble once you're in team rumble you're gonna want to go somewhere where there's not a lot of players however you do want it to be somewhat of a popular POI so what I like to do is, is try to jump and go further away from the circle or just look at the mini-map and see where you're your teammates are going and uh, and go where they're not you want to go somewhere where there's going to be significant amount of loot and once you get there you're going to want to go really 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 fast you want to run through everything uh, try to get as much as you can the idea is to try to get multiple launch pads you're probably going to get at least one it's very easy to find them in team rumble and uh, and you shouldn't have too many problems but if you do don't worry you're not out of the game yet you're probably going to find 18,000 more launch pads on the ground further into the game so if you get unlucky you don't find any launch pads don't worry but raid the place I'm sure you'll find a few and you're gonna want to hold on to those you're not gonna want to use them when you see somebody you're gonna want to wait until the end of the game and I wouldn't say the very end of the game but once you get down to that main circle so what's gonna happen is you're gonna stack your launch pads you're gonna wait until the game progresses a little bit to where the storm has moved and there is a single circle and uh, and everyone is kind of just going crazy now what's what's fortunate for those of you that aren't gonna get any launch pads uh, there's other players that will and you will find them everywhere in the final circle in team rumble when you get into the main circle there's launch pads everywhere and 30 seconds is a long time when you have you you know 18 players running around and they're all in a small circle and they're respawning so if you've got your launch pads wait until you get down to the circle then you can put it down somewhere I would recommend putting it somewhere um, that it's not gonna get shot down pretty quickly I would put it like up on a mountain or uh, or down you know behind something put walls around it so that it doesn't get shot just in case you don't manage to get the, that those 100 damage points within that 30 seconds you can kind of just run back and do it again uh, but again, like I said, for those of you that are, are unfortunate and don't get launch pads at the beginning of the game, don't worry. Just go to the final circle. You're going to find them everywhere. Players put them down regardless of this challenge, and uh, and you'll be able to knock this out. 100 damage is really not that much whatsoever, especially with everyone using shield. So hit the launch pad, um, hit the ground, and uh, and start shooting at somebody. should be very easy to do. But if you guys have any problems or any questions with this challenge, make sure to leave them down in the comment section below, and I'll be sure to try and help some of you guys out. You guys can also reach me on Twitter or Instagram at Dylan Fro. Links to all my social media can be found down in the description. But again, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I'll see all you guys in the next video.